Celia Fenn The Great Expansion of Consciousness and the Phoenix Eclipses April May 2022 Beloved Family of Light, you are at this time experiencing a major expansion of consciousness that culminates on the 12th of April 2022. Those of you who have followed the path of ascension have worked for many years to raise your frequency and expand your consciousness. This has allowed you to empower yourselves and to become soul-embodied masters of energy on earth. You have activated the original template of the human angel within your DNA and stepped forward to become the empowered new earth human. This present expansion of consciousness that began in January of 2022 and culminates on the 12th of April, is the moment when you become aware that you are, in your higher consciousness and in multidimensional awareness, an inherent part of nature and of the planet. You become aware, beloveds, that the same divine soul and intelligence that is in you is also in all things on the planet. There is no separation between trees, animals, plants, rocks and humans. They are all expressions of divine creative manifestation and divine will. The idea of oneness that is part of fifth dimensional consciousness, means that you see the divine creative fire within all things. What does this mean for you, you may ask? Well, as you expand your consciousness and do your inner work of balancing and empowerment, you also expand your energy signature. The coherence and harmony that expands outwards into your energy field from your sacred heart creates a field of coherence that connects with and enhances the field in nature. Your organic coherent field connects with the organic coherent field in nature, merging and creating a field of miracles and beauty. That is why, when you are open and connected to the field of nature, you are able to create and generate miracles in your life. The divine flow is magnified and synchronicity is accelerated. That is why being in nature can be such a healing experience for you. When you are out of balance and energy field is distorted, being within a coherent field allows you to balance and heal your field through a process of resonant assimilation. But, beloveds, it also works the other way. When you are a master of energy and a multidimensional being, you can be a healing force where nature has been damaged and distorted. Your powerful energy signature manifests a creative field that can assist nature to return to coherence and harmony. In this expansion phase, as you step up and step into your mastery, many of you will understand that this is a part of your purpose. You will hold energy for the planet and for nature to heal. You will be stewards and keepers of the garden of the new earth simply by achieving and holding this coherent and harmonious energy within your sacred heart and within your energy signature. You may be aware of being called to certain places on the earth simply to be there and to hold a field of love and coherence for the planet. This is also the sacred energy of the Divine Mother at work, for where you walk flowers will spring up and trees will blossom. Beloved ones, when the consciousness of the peaceful garden is within you, then it will manifest around you as your environment. Your inner joy and harmony will be reflected back to you by nature. Beloved ones, this is a true blessing as you recognize that your creative energy as a human angel can spark creative fire in nature too. The Phoenix Eclipses the partial solar eclipse in Taurus on the 30th April and the total lunar eclipse in Scorpio on the 16th May will be moments when new light codes for the new Earth will be installed in the planetary grids and in your light bodies. The phoenix is one of the symbols for Scorpio, and it signifies the creative transformation of death and rebirth. At this time, old structures will fall away and you will birth the new structures that will contain the energies of the new Earth as individuals and as families and communities. As individuals, you will create coherent and powerful energy signatures that will draw to you those who are your soul family and tribe. Together, you will begin to create family and community structures of love, compassion, harmony, peace, and coherence. As you come together you will create support for the fields of others and of nature. No matter how chaotic and disharmonious events may be on the lower levels of consciousness, you will be able to hold your field of love, peace and harmony as a coherent planetary expression of divine love. 
you will truly begin writing the story of divine love within the pages of the Book of Love that is the record of your adventures on Earth. The Partial Solar Eclipse Slash New Moon in Taurus 30th April The first eclipse of 2022 falls in Taurus. This is the part of the galactic space ruled by the royal star Aldebaran, and the season in which the sun transits Orion, Sirius and the Pleiades. Part has many historical and evolutionary links to these star systems, and a spiral transit always renews connections and allows for new light code upgrades to be integrated. This year's eclipse will intensify this process. Taurus is the sign that allows you to focus on home, both personal and planetary, as well as finances. So, you can expect major shifts and expansions in these areas. It is good to be open and prepared for such opportunities. The Light Council of Aldebaran is the galactic body that oversees the shift in the timeline spirals, together with those of Regulus, and Teres, and Formalout. As you expand consciousness and open to your galactic ancestral lineage, you will be able to play your part in receiving and integrating new light codes for the new Earth. As the partial solar eclipse falls on a new moon, you can also expect this to be a time of new beginnings. The Total Lunar Eclipse in Scorpio 16th May This lunar eclipse will be a deep dive and an intense experience. It may feel as though everything is crashing down and all structures are failing, and yet at the same time a miraculous birth is taking place. You are rebirthing for your place and space in the new earth. You may feel called to move to a new place, begin a new project or change your work. Whatever call you receive, it will move you closer to your heart and your soul's passion. It is important to allow yourself to implode and rebirth if this is necessary at this time. You may have already been in this process, so this eclipse will allow you to clarify and complete the process. The Scorpio full moon is also associated with the enlightenment of the Buddha, so it is a good time to allow the golden light of awakening to radiate from your soul. May your energy signature be light and pure. May you be the holy grail that carries the golden light of the Christ consciousness. May your sacred heart be alive with passion and compassion. May you be the sword of balance and truth.